Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. Happy New Year, everybody, from um, Animal Services here in San Luis Obispo. It's a new year, and we still have dogs. We were hoping everyone would get home for the holidays, but they didn't quite get there. So we have a house full of dogs and cats that need homes, and um, one of them is right there. It's Coco, Deborah. Now, last time the folks saw Coco, she was all dressed up in a Santa hat, and she had some holly around her neck, and she didn't get taken home for the holidays. Which is unbelievable, because she's such a great girl. So uh, now she's very emphatically saying, adopt me. Come take me home. It's written on my bandana that right means here. you have to come You have to me. come. Um, to make it easier, half of her adoption fee is paid, so that's nice. It doesn't cost you quite so much money to come get a dog from Animal Services. And, of course, our adoptions include their spay-neuter surgeries, microchips, shots, all that kind of great stuff. What a deal, huh? It is a deal. And what about this great dog, Coco? She needs to get adopted. Her she ID number is 201-966. This is Coco, and isn't she pretty? Here's a newcomer to the shelter. This dog is male. He's just about five years old. <laughs> Isn't he adorable? How can somebody let this dog go? I know somebody's missing him. We found him in Paso Robles on the 3rd of January at Scott Street and Sherwood Park area. Are you missing this dog? I'd be missing this dog if it were mine. Uh, if this dog does not get picked up by his owner, we're going to name him Potter. And his ID number is 203342. So if he's yours, come and get him. If he's not, come and adopt him. 203342. Potter. This adorable little guy does not like the shelter very much. He's frightened down here. But boy, has he come around incredibly. Um, he's a little freaked out by the whole, by the cameras and all that kind of stuff. But this is Lewis. He's a great little guy, and he is also Volunteer's Pick of the Month, which means more than $50 has been paid towards his adoption fee, so that saves you over $50 and gets, hopefully will get this great little guy into a home. So he just needs someone understanding that they know he's a little bit shy and scared, but, boy, once he knows you, he absolutely loves you to death. So, and you'll love him to death, too, I promise you. So please come and meet Lewis, ID number 202-723. Here is one of the shelter favorites. She's got that big old grin on her face. She is so cute. This is Tinkerbell. She's a wonderful ball dog. She's very good on the leash, very easy to walk. She's beautiful. She's about six or seven years old. So she's, you know, she's that great sort of middle age area where it's still got a lot of energy, lots of fun, but she's not wild and crazy. So she is just a wonderful dog with half of her adoption fee paid. Yes, half the adoption fee. So if you come and you fall in love with Tinkerbell, Half that money stays in your pocket. I think that's a great thing. I think so, too. Mm -hmm. Tinkerbell's ID number is 153122. All right, calling all soft hearts out there. This is Trio. He's a gorgeous male boxer, and normally he wouldn't need any extra help to get out of here because boxers move through here really quickly to get adopted fast, but Trio only has three legs. He's missing one of his back legs. And so for that reason, you know, people are a little reluctant to take that on. That missing leg does not bother this dog one little bit. Um, so please, consider adopting him half of his adoption fee. Wow, a lot of our dogs I have know. half their adoption fees paid. This is wonderful. Folks have been very good to these dogs, Deborah. They have come in and paid half their fee just to get them out of here and fast. Very Go. kind and wonderful. So mm -hmm. please consider Trio. He's great. ID number 202-966. Oh, this is Snuggle. He's one of our senior babies down here right now. Um, he's, we think, about maybe 10, 11 years old. He is very full of life. He does not act like an older dog at all. He can be a little vocal, but, you know, he's a beagle. What do you want? That's what they do. Um, and, I, uh, you know, he's probably more so down here than he would be in a home because he's always trying to get <laughs> attention. God, he is so cute. Um, he has the senior rebate, which means if you adopt one of our older dogs, you get $35 back for your adoption fee, which is very nice. And Snuggle is just a great little guy and does not deserve to be here. So he just told you, come get me. Snuggle's ID number is 191920.
I don't know. Val might be coming up on being our longest residing dog. I'm not sure, but she's way up there, and I don't get it. There's nothing bad about this dog. She is um, easygoing. She is calm. She gets along well with other dogs. She loves to be outdoors. She loves the water. She went on a foster hiking trip with foster parents with their chihuahua, did great. She's just a really super nice dog. She's kind of low-key. She's depressed in here, so she stays on her bed. Uh, a lot, so people don't think she's interested in them. That's not true. She's just bummed out she's been here so long. Deborah, it's time for her to go. It is time for her to get out of here, and half of her adoption fee is paid as well, so that saves you more than $50 when you adopt her. Um, she's wonderful. There is not a bad thing to say about this beautiful dog. Val's ID number is 171165, and by the way, she seems to be afraid of cats. So if you got cats, this is not a problem. What more do you want? This is Ciara. She is a gorgeous creature. She's pretty high energy, so she needs to go with an experienced dog person. Um, she likes other dogs, prefers, definitely, though, prefers males. But she is a lot of fun. She's extremely loving. She's got that beautiful brindle coat. Half of her adoption fee is paid as well. So there's another one. And Ciara's ID number is 202571. <laughs> okay, so Laura. Uh, you have never met a more enthusiastic dog than you're going to find in Trey. And he's called Trey because like Trio, he's only got three legs. He doesn't care. It doesn't stop him. He's going to do what he wants to do. He's about five years old. He's got half of his adoption fee paid. This is great. And he's wonderful. He does not care that he does not have that leg. Does not bother him a bit. ID number 203094. This is Trey. This super cute little guy's name is Alfredo, just a year old. Um, they were found stray in Arroyo Grande. He and his friend Alice, who we'll see a little later, absolutely adorable dogs. Terrified when they got here, doing so much better. They are just sweet, barely out of puppyhood little dogs. ID number 203089. If you want something between a small and medium-sized dog, Alfredo is perfect. We promised you Alice, and there she is. This is, I assume, Alfredo's sister, and you can see she's a little shaky and scared, but she's a darling little dog. Just about a year old, Alice's ID number is 203090. This is another young dog, just about a year old. We are calling him Austin. He's a very nice little guy. He's very good on the, the leash. He's got a lot of energy, but not crazy energy. Just an all-around good little dog. He's learning agility down here. He's having a good time. Well, I don't know if he's having a good time. He'd rather have that somewhere else, but he's doing great. Austin's ID number is 202-965. This is the best thing you can possibly do for your companion animal. Put a collar and a tag on your friend, your dog, your cat. If they get lost, they'll get brought home to you rather than being brought to a shelter or a pound where overpopulation means that somebody gets euthanized. So please protect everybody. And folks, even if you have a collar or tag and identification on your pet, ask your neighbor if they do. If you see that a neighbor doesn't, please encourage them to identify their animal. It will save everybody's life and keep everybody alive. This little guy is as sweet as he can be. He looks like he's an Aussie Border Collie mix. He was left in our night kennels um, on the 3rd of January. So I would be surprised if somebody's not missing their young, maybe year old dog. So he's down here waiting for you to find him. And if nobody comes to find him, he's also up for adoption. So everyone come get this great guy. He won't be here long. He's just too great size, great personality, very sweet. ID number 203-325. This is a very pretty little mini pincher or mini pincher mix. She's adorable. Her name, we're calling her Eva. Uh, she was found on the 26th of December in Paso Robles. So someone might be missing their adorable dog, but she's definitely up for adoption and she's very sweet. 
Deborah, she might have the ears of the day. She might. Those are, you know, percentage-wise, of body size, that's a very large percentage of ear on that dog. And she's cute. Her ID number is 203200. This is little Eva. This is little teeny tiny Bambi. She's kind of almost a smaller version of the dog we just saw. She's, um, she's a sweet little girl. She's scared down here, but she's warming up, and she's just a very nice, sweet little lap dog. She's got half of her adoption fee paid, so there's some good news for you. Uh, her ID number is 203054. If you're looking for a little companion, someone to hang around with you a whole lot and just be happy hanging around with you, Bambi is perfect. Oh, I love this girl. Just a little pocket-sized pity named Rosie. She's three years old. She looks like a puppy. She's so small. Um, she's, she's fun. She's good with other dogs. She's just a really nice dog unless you're a cat. She does not do cats, but we have several dogs we can say that about. Um, she's funny. Her ID number is 195252. This is Rosie. This is the big old hunk of the shelter right now. This is Bear. He's about two years old. He's just, he's very loving, very sweet, big guy. ID number 203322. Come meet him. He's pretty cool. Very, you know, he loves love. That's Bear. This is Blue, three-year-old Labrador ret retriever, um, high-energy boy. Uh, so he definitely needs to go to an active home. He cannot go to cat, a cat household. He also does not like cats. He's about three years old. He's, he's happy. He's healthy. He's funny. But he got a lot of energy. So needs to go to an active household. Blue's ID number is 195254. Oh, my gosh. This is little Hansel. We think he's just about five months old, so he's not going to be a teeny tiny chihuahua mix. I'm not even entirely sure he's a chihuahua mix, but he sure is cute. <laughs> so little Hansel's ID number is 203244. Oh, look at those ears. Oh, gosh, he's cute. So here I am out with one of my good friends. This is where we go walking our dogs. We get to sit on some park benches now and again. It was a great opportunity for you guys to come out. We need volunteers. We'd really like some more dog walkers. We're at a point now where we just don't have enough people walking the dogs, and these dogs have to stay in their kennel day in and day out, 24 by 7. These dogs really need to get out, have a little exercise, feel the grass. You can sit with them out here, socialize them. It makes them ever so much more adoptable. So if you've got any time whatsoever, we could use you down here. Bring a friend. Two of you walk dogs together. We have dogs that get along with other dogs that you can go out with together. It's a fabulous opportunity for both you and the dog. We'd love to see you down here. It's easy to be a volunteer. We're a great bunch of people. I guarantee it. You can have a lot of fun and help the dogs. Think about it. Marilyn, ha Marilyn has a lot of exuberance. That's what all the volunteers have to say. She loves to jog by your side. She is a great ball dog. She's playful as can be. She makes you laugh every single day. You just have to see this gal in action and you will smile. She is affectionate and she seems to like women better than men, but I don't know. Depends on who you are. Her name is Marilyn. She is ID number 201307 and half her adoption fee is paid. Although for this gal, Full price is a bargain. Consider Marilyn 201307. This is a great looking Queensland mix, gorgeous dog. He was found on the 2nd of January in Paso Robles at Vine and 34th. And um, he was real shy when he came in, but he's doing so much better. He's a beautiful little dog, probably only a year old. And we're going to call him Rory, and I think you would be really lucky to get down here and adopt this dog. He's terrific. ID number 203306. We're calling this pretty pointer um, Abby. She was, 
found as a stray. I can't, she's probably 10, 12 years old. Just can't believe nobody's looking for this sweet, wonderful dog. She's lovely, she's gentle, she's, she needs some place to retire. Her ID number is 203217, and of course she is eligible for the senior rebate, so you would get $35 back on her adoption fee. Just a beautiful, sweet girl, does not deserve to be down here. 203217, get her out, please. This is Bandit, just an adorable little dog, about five years old, precious. You know, he's just a nice little dog that needs a good home. Um, ID number 202996. These little guys are usually pretty easy keepers. Oh, look at how happy he is to have some attention. This beauty's name is Roxy. She's just seven months old. Um, her owners could no longer keep her, unfortunately. She's a puppy, but she's pretty calm and, and low-key, at least at this point, for a shepherd puppy. She seems, she seems really lovely, really nice dog. So she'll go fast. So if you're interested in young shepherds, come take a look at Roxy. ID number 203-353. This is a pretty adorable newcomer to the shelter, picked up in Rio Grande at Branch Street and Oak Park Boulevard on the 3rd of January. Uh, a little male poodle that is probably about six years old, we think. Really cute, really nice, super good-natured dog. ID number 203321. I hope owners come looking for him, and if not, I hope you come and adopt him because he is a nice dog. And here we have another newcomer to the shelter, uh, probably picked up with that last dog we just saw in Arroyo Grande on the 3rd of January. Also, sweet-natured, happy little dog we're estimating to be about six years old. This little cutie's ID number is 203323, and he is just adorable. This little cutie pie is named Rocky. He is a shelter favorite. He's wearing the comb because he kept licking his neuter stitches, but he's a great little dog. He's good with other dogs. He's happy, seems to be house trained, easy to walk on the leash, just an all around nice dog. Rocky's ID number is 167029. Okay, so now it's time to see our cats, and we're starting out with Chanel. For this new year, Chanel is our first cat up, and she's saying, come on down here and get me out of here. Chanel is about two years old, and her night ID number is 203130, and as you can see, she's a very pretty black and white. Take a look at Chanel. ID number 203130. She's a real talker. Next up, we've got Mally, and Mally is a little boy. He is just about two years old, and his ID number is 202899. That's Mally. Well, here's a real pretty girl. This is Jenna, and Jenna is a tortoiseshell. We don't have many of them lately. We used to have an awful lot of tortoiseshells, but... Not anymore, maybe one or two at the shelter at any one time. She is a pretty girl, and she just so happens to be a senior. Yes, she is, and so we offer a senior rebate. Any senior, you get $35 back on your adoption fee. That's great. Jenna's ID number is 203263, and you have to meet her. That's Jenna, 203263. Hi, Eddie. Or do you pronounce your name Edie? Yes, I think you pronounce your, you pronounce your name Edie because you're a girl. Uh, Edie is also a uh, senior. That means $35 off her adoption fee. And as you can see, she is also a tortoise shell. Edie's ID number, 203115. She loves to be petted. She loves to be on your lap. Take a look at Edie, 203115.
Well, you're looking at a really handsome cat, and his name is Java Joe. So for whatever reason, I think he'd like to sit with you while you're having coffee. He is just about three years old, and his ID number is 203205. His markings are really, really nice. Take a look at Java Joe, ID number 203205. Here's a big boy. This is Tiger. He's just about five years old, and he is a gorgeous long-haired tabby. If you guys like that Maine Coon look, Tiger's the one for you. ID number 203245, Tiger. Here's a little scaredy guy. Well, he's a big scaredy guy. Actually, a lot of cats are like this here at the shelter when they first come in, and he's kind of a newcomer to the shelter. Uh, this is why we need you to think about volunteering down here, because you would be so surprised to see what a uh, fast turnaround these cats make when volunteers get them out of their cages, groom them, brush them, talk to them. It makes such a difference to the cat. It's amazing to see how the cat comes out of its shyness and then readily gets adopted. So if you like cats, please come and volunteer with us. Call the volunteer line, 781-4413, and leave your name and number, and we'll get back to you about volunteering here. You'll love it. I guarantee it. Right now, we're going to talk about OJ, who is a very nice orange tabby. He is just about three years old, and his ID number is 203312. That's OJ. Hey, Chili, how are you doing today? Chili has been here since the beginning of December. Not so happy about that. One whole month here. Chili is a tortoiseshell, and I told you we don't have many tortoiseshells here usually, but today we've got three of them. She is a really nice cat, a sweetheart, the volunteers say. Her ID number, 202687, and guess what? If you adopt Chili, she has half her adoption fee already paid for you. That's right. So you can keep half that adoption fee, which is $40, right in your pocket, and get Chili out of here. ID number, 202687. Chili. I think you will agree with me that Mama Kitty is a real looker. She is gorgeous. She is a long-haired, long-haired, dilute calico. Yes, she is. She is um, ID number 202906. And Mama Kitty is a senior. What does that mean to you? If you adopt her, $35 back on your adoption fee. That's a deal. ID number 202906. Can't you just see Mama Kitty on your lap? That would be yummy. ID number 202906. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. We found this cat on the 2nd of January in Paso Robles at Southview and Airport. This cat is about two years old and male. ID number 203313. Do you recognize this cat? If so, give us a call. His ID number 203313. Look at this handsome guy. This guy we found in Cambria uh, on the 2nd of January on the 2600 block of Main Street. Do you recognize him? He is male, just about a year old. His ID number is 203319, and if his owner doesn't claim him, we're going to call him Knight, and he'll be available for adoption. So consider Knight, 203319. You really have to come down here to see this cat to appreciate her markings. She is a, I'd say a black tabby. She's got very interesting markings. 
She is female, and she came to us on the 2nd of January from San Luis, Johnson and Bouchon. She is female. Her ID number is 203297. If she doesn't get collected by her owner, we're calling her Cindy, and she'll be available for adoption. So come on down and meet her. ID number 203297. Well, you know, there's not much to do around this shelter, especially for the cats, especially in these small spaces that they live in. So there's a lot of sleeping and snoozing going on. Cats get pretty bored here fast, and some cats have to leave about, live here about two months before they get adopted, some of them. Consider that. So here's how you can help. If you want, you can adopt a cat down here, fine. If not, how about volunteering to get a cat like this out of his cage, on your lap, petted, groomed, talking to him, he'll really come around. But for now, we'll talk about adopting him, if he'd ever wake up. His name is Prince. He's about three years old. He is a Seal Point Himalayan, and his ID number is 203326. Say hi to Anthony. He is a tabby on white, and he is also a senior, which gives you the senior rebate. $35 back in your pocket if you fancy Anthony. He is ID number 202942. Anthony. Here is a real cutie pie. This is Mimi. She is very petite and very young. She is just about a year and a month old. She is female. She is ID number 203246. That's Mimi. Yes, you're right. This is not a cat. This is not a dog. This is a bunny. We have um, Huckleberry here for you. He has been here since the October 10th. Imagine that. Would you like to adopt a bunny? Huckleberry is male, just about a year old, and his ID number is 201957, and he represents the bunnies we have down here. I think we have two more. Huckleberry, 201957. Think about adopting, think about volunteering, come down to the shelter and see our animals.